and the idea behind this title was to kind of make it personable, discuss our time from our perspective. So the stories that are showing within the exhibition are actually very much about a personal history that, are, that, that is really coming up, personal archives. But the exhibition kind of looks at a few things at the same time. The 90s in the UAE is at the core of the exhibition. Um, and then to kind of look at the 90s in the UAE, um, you begin to dissect and, and look at architecture, the migration um, of uh, various nationalities into the UAE, rerouting and uh, sort of starting families here. And of course, um, you have the idea of globalization that has come into play uh, at, and has been at the forefront of, uh, of the 90s. And so the space are kind of looking at a few things. You have interior spaces and the privacy of interior spaces and what that looks like. And also bringing to life um, a culture or a subculture that has existed you know, in the UAE for a very long time, which I think is extremely important, especially looking at the 90s and uh, again, talking about migration, you know, the, uh, um, uh, looking at you know, looking at the various um, different individuals that did come into the, the UAE in the 90s, um, people from India and the migration from India was one that was very prev prevalent and present um, in the UAE during this time. An event like Zemanna encourages one thing, which is dialogue. We are missing a lot of dialogue in the art field. What I mean by that is that when you have visitors come in, normal visitors, like people who come in and they're seeking nostalgia, like you mentioned. But when I get into an engagement and sort of a dialogue with them, they start to experience something different with what they see, and that's what art is all about. You want the viewer or the receiver to react to something that he watches, whether it was a nice memory of something he saw or was it an experience that he wanted to share.